I'm Sally Starflower from Bedford. Yeah. And um, I uh, sometimes facilitate open mics down there, and I facilitate a drum circle, which is happening Sunday, 4 o'clock. And uh, there's another drum circle happening upstairs Sunday at 4 o'clock. So don't miss one of them. Have a good time. Um, so I started writing poetry when I retired. And um, I'm going to read some of that to you today. I do write songs. I am in a band. And I play the bass and the drum and learning to play the guitar. <laughs> <laughs> so here we go. This is one that I, one of my first ones that I wrote um, probably in 2008. Shattered by a muse. We cannot know how the muse will capture us. A sound wave emanating from the shadows of mind, words unpredictably twisting rhyme. Souls lose their way in her passion of flames, mesmerized on waves of vibration. Heartstrings get trapped in illusion. Her alluring voice whispers to our yearnings, impersonating truth under veils of promise. Aphrodite weaves a spell of infatuation. Secrets cloaked in silence unlock fear when her magic transmutes into madness, leaving us alone in a sea of longing. As her songs fade into distant echoes washed away by the tears, our hearts are shattered. Yet between the jagged shards of disappointment, a new melody emerges out of the fog as another tragic love song is born. This one's called Kaleidoscope. Uh, most of my songs that I write are tragic love songs, but my poetry ranges uh, a little bit further, and I usually write about music or nature or love or something like that. This one is kind of about life. Kaleidoscope. A kaleidoscope of experiences shape me to be who I see. Shards of memories like colored glass reflect aspects of emotions standing naked in the light. A twist in the tunnel of time changes perspective in the blink of an eye. Moments resolve into divergent stories when viewed from different directions. I am both the seen and the seer, seamlessly switching dimensions as the angle shifts. Past and present blur in a sea of sensation. Differentiation is hopeless. Fleeting images escape capture, tumbling moment by moment in a never-ending spiral spinning back into itself. Kaleidoscope. like. That's what I was trying to describe, how it looks. All right. So this is truly one of my first poems. Um, a lot of my creativity came out of a program called The Artist's Way by Julia Cameron. If you ever get a chance to do a self uh, looking inward creativity program, check out The Artist Way. This one's called Pacing Artist Dreams. Life is full to the brim as spring bursts forth all at once. Deep potential waiting to bloom. Ideas blossom unending within. I can barely keep up with the pace of my dreams. My art creative creations come to being. I marvel wanting more, all energy focused on my path. Flitting here, flying there, a butterfly, freed to embrace choice among the panoply of colors. 
seeking joy, finding bliss, avoiding pain and the mundane. I won't grow up, shouts my inner self. Find balance is my muse's challenge. Breathe deep, she says, and flow. Thank you. I have one more. This one is not my own, but um, I, I actually found it on the internet, but it's pretty um, appropriate, so. Just never give up. It's never too late to start something new, believe me. This is called I Am Not Old by Samantha Reynolds. I am not old, she said. I'm rare. I am the standing ovation at the end of the play. I am the retrospective of my life as art. I am the hours connected like dots into good sense. I am the fullness of existing. You think I am waiting to die, but I am waiting to be found. I am a treasure. I am a map. And these wrinkles are imprints of my journey. Ask me anything. Thank you. So try out your poetry creativity sometime. 